<laughs> Don't know. Adam? How are we doing? Good, how are you? Good. So how's the Neva made up? It's alright. It's alright. But uh, every now and again it gives way. That's why I want to have that on. Yeah. So look at this goalkeeping coach saying I'm a fucking cop, he actually won't sleep Just spilled my coffee over Yeah, Yeah, I because we know most. Well, I'm not the captain. So we know most of them. When we play dinner, it's all We're here today with the Bentley Village President Adam Deacon. How are we doing on this Wednesday night? Really good, mate. Good to see you. Um, Decent start to the season, seven points, two wins, one draw. They've had um, two defeats. How do you think that plays into the game tonight? Um, I think we're probably a little bit disappointed with the last result. 2-2, two, two. all in all, probably feels like two points dropped. I think we probably should have won that game, should have put it to bed a bit earlier, but credit to Royston, they played well, they could battle back and they worked hard. Um, it's very hard to look into form at the start of the season because we, we don't know, you don't know what type of side these are going to feel today. Um, it could be completely different to what they feel at the weekend, so we'll just take well, every game as it comes and give it its best to see how we go. Um, quite a uh, similar squad to the sa to Saturday, but uh, three different attacking starters. Uh, the uh, the big subs came on, Ryan, Joe and Michael Attar, Billy. Uh, all came on, made a big difference. One of the game, they're all starting tonight. Is that is it just a pretty simple swap for them coming in? Uh, they did make an impact when they came on, but that's that's what substitutes are there for sometimes. It, when people are playing well or they're not playing great, you know, you, you've got to take your chance when it comes. So I think possibly that might have just been give them a little nudge and push them on, but they, they definitely made a difference when they came on. I'm not saying the lads that came off didn't play well as well, they, they did. Uh, but they brought a different energy and uh, brought something a bit different to the game and it changed the result in the end. I think um, probably the talk of the town so far for Village is uh, Aidan Davies' breakout performance so far in this season. Uh, played his first game of the season August 3rd, since then 12 goals in all competitions. What do you have to say to that? Yeah, I mean he's on fire, he's really on form. He's a player that plays, when he's playing with confidence he's very hard to handle, You know, he's big, he's strong. Um, and at the moment he doesn't look like missing so uh, we need to keep getting the chances to him if we keep doing that he'll keep scoring so obviously we want him to carry on in this form to the end of the season um, but yeah he's on he's on for a big tally at the minute if he keeps it keeps it going um, and one last question it's a big statement uh, back in the squad for the first time of the season first time he's been involved with any pre-season or the all competitive games in the 24-25 calendar. Um, Connor Evans returns, manager's player of the season last year. The last time he was in the squad was the cup final. What do you have to say uh, about his return to the... Oh, it's great to have him back. He's an excellent player. Everyone knows how good Connor is. Uh, he came training again last week and obviously brilliant to have him back. You know, uh, we need to get him back in, get playing and get him playing regularly. And we know what he's capable of and we know what he brings to the team. So. Um, it's great to see him back and say hopefully we'll see him a bit more now. Um, maybe, so, one last question. Any score predictions for tonight? Um, I'd take any form of win against any team, but it's hard to say really. The pitch looks good, um, the conditions look great, so hopefully we can play a bit of football and score a few goals. So I'm going to say 5-1. Right. Well, well, that's very hopeful. Hopefully we can get a good result. We'll leave you to it. This is out of my usual jurisdiction. Sorry? This is out of my usual jurisdiction.
I'm not sure if I've stored them picture or not. What you have now? <laughs> Sorry, I've got it. It's a fleet. You know what I said? It's a fleet. Please, What's the prediction, Roper? Oh, prediction? What do you want, Bentley? If I know, where can we keep it? 3 0. Raph, I want a, a prediction. Huh? Prediction. prediction. Yeah, for the game. Oh. For a win, aren't we, boys? For a win? Yeah, I'm going to Book up. Yeah, boys. Yeah, I've got a goal at far end of our war. Where's Cam? Chances, wasn't it? Like, to be fair, but it's a tight pitch. He's got it's scrappy, so you can't keep missing sitters. And because it's so small, we're all written everything. Should have scored that pen. Sad that we. Uh, yeah, it was poor. Probably, probably would have been good to get a goal before uh, half time. But... Yeah, and the follow up as well, like keeper up for them. So. Hopefully, we can uh, become fresh, get back in the second half. Yeah, I mean, I think maybe going up hill might help us. <coughs> yeah. Everything's been running through, hasn't it? Mm. So. Just hope we can get some moments, eh? Get a few moments. I think once we get one, <laughs> we'll get a few. Just getting that first one. Let's get one. Yeah, I'll just take one. That's to do me at the moment. Yeah. Yeah, it's rock, mate. Well, you're in there, drive. Go on, Aiden. It worked, then. It feels good. Drake, 18. Get in. Oh, oh save, Aiden. Oh, 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 that were in. Be aware. Be your four. Fucking hell, it's boring now. Get in. Yes! Go 
Watch it, don't say. That's a great ball. Oh. What a ball in that is, by the way. Hey, Jay, that's quality. Thank you. 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 Thank Lomba Village. We're here today with assistant manager Ado after a big win. How? What's your immediate reaction from that game? Love it. Second half in particular were really good. First half we didn't hit the heights that we normally normally get to and the standards that we've set. But second half we had a chat with him at half time. Second half to come out and uh, done done what they've been been told to do. So yeah, you come midweek away, half hour away from home. You take any result really, but a five 0 win. It could have been more. A uh, few missed chances, but yeah, roll on to Saturday where there's a massive game for us. Obviously, the first 45 minutes were kind of disappointing. If you had to sum up kind of how that chat was at half time, uh, lads kind of knew themselves that they're not at the heights that they that they've set in in recent weeks. So uh, it was quite an easy chat with them. They understood what we wanted of them, and then straight away they implemented it, and uh, and we kicked on in second half, and they didn't really get near us to be honest. All they didn't have a save to make. Obviously, a big game Saturday. How 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 do Villa just keep moving on in these games? Just take the confidence from this second half, roll it straight into Saturday. It's a big test for us. Uh, they're up there. Uh, they've, I don't know if they've got a game this evening or all, but they've, they've won all the games so far. So it'll be interesting to to see what level we're at, really. But uh, I'm confident in our lads that uh, we can go there and and get a result. Obviously, uh, I mentioned to Adam before the game about Aidan Davies's run. It's just incredible at the minute, isn't it? It's unstoppable. Oh, it's massive. He's moved into this number nine position uh, and uh, he's, he's scoring. Confidence is high. Uh, he looks sharp. Uh, so, yeah, there's just plenty of goals in him. So, let's hope he can keep that one going. Well, hopefully, uh, we can keep it going and hopefully, we get a win on Saturday. Thank you for the, uh, the interview. Yeah, no worries. We are Mon the Village. Mon the Village. Mon the Village.